Police sources say this is the Madison Avenue building where they discovered the body of 25 year old Tyrell Shaw. He hung himself in an elevator shaft. Police had been searching for him for weeks, suspecting him of randomly attacking Asian women in Manhattan. Tonight, they found him. Karen Bennett works in the building. This morning, it smelled horrible. I hate to say it, but we were saying it smells like something died in there. Shaw was accused of playing what he called the nose game, picking a random Asian woman and then hitting her in the face with a hard object in a plastic bag. He had allegedly attacked four women since early June. This woman was attacked on 60th Street and 2nd Avenue. She asked not to be identified. She said, oh, all Asian girls doesn't talk to me. I, he can never get the phone number. And then I just ignore him. I didn't say anything. And then just after the next second, he just hit my face. Shaw made similar statements on social media and in multiple blog entries, wanting to give Asian women a, quote, legitimate reason to hate him. He even spoke of killing himself in an elevator shaft. Police say he died a few days ago, but was found this evening. Karen says they had a squatter in the building last year. She believes it was Shaw before he started attacking women. Her co-worker confronted him. He was hiding in the closet. Um, and so he banged, my coworker banged on the door and said, I'm gonna call the police. And he just opened the door, walked out, grabbed his phone and ran down the stairs. How he got back in the building is unclear, but some relief in the neighborhood tonight that a dangerous person is no longer a threat. This is a very uh, sad and bizarre end, but it's an end in some